Griezmann equalised for France in their game against Tunisia, but the goal was ruled out for offside. Let's take a look at the decision in more detail. Firstly, Griezmann is offside when the ball is played, that's clear. However, the question is whether the Tunisia defender deliberately played the ball, which would reset the offside phase and put Griezmann onside. Deliberate play is a subjective decision by VAR and the referee, and in this case they decided that the Tunisia player didn't deliberately play the ball because he was under pressure and was stretching to get to the ball. Therefore, he didn't have control over where it went. If the Tunisia player had jumped ahead of the ball without pressure from the French player, his header would likely have been considered a deliberate play, and the goal would have been allowed to stand. It's a controversial decision, but technically it's correct in accordance with the laws of the game. The other controversial part of this incident was that the referee actually allowed play to restart after the goal, only for a brief second, and then blew the full-time whistle. Once play has actually restarted, VAR protocol does not allow a review, and so there is an argument that the review should not have happened in the first place. It's a messy situation, but the laws of the game do not allow for a change to the result, even if a clear mistake has been made. Let us know your thoughts and questions in the comments below.